bastard, you're gonna pay for shooting up my ride. Hi, Deofig here. I grew up playing first-person shooters in the late 90s and early 2000s. I love the gameplay, the humor, and the art style that had a touch of realism that kept the games grounded. Starting sometime last year, I began messing around with Unity, testing out an idea for an FPS I ended up dropping for the current project I'm working on now. It was going to be about a hero sucked into a mishmash video game world that had different environmental areas, bosses, etc. I made it as far as the beginning of a map, with some textures and models I made, and stuff you could shoot. In October of 2020, I upgraded my computer and started a new project. I even tried the voxel models from the previous version, but had lights going through cracks between voxels, so I dumped that idea and eventually gave up on making my own textures in lieu of using the plethora of free materials available out there. It's just quicker and gives me a result I like. Eventually, I also upgraded to the URP in Unity so I can take advantage of decals, shaders, and a few other things down the road. The name Trailer Trash came to me one day because I live in a trailer. I figured doing something based on the type of areas I'm familiar with would be a good idea. I live in a smallish town in the Pacific Northwest, where we have trees, trailers, and not much else. If someone owns an actual house, there's a trailer on the property that is being lived in as well. I want gameplay similar to Duke Nukem 3D. It's honestly my favorite game of all time. I have not really played anything that smacks that gameplay loop the same. I love Shadow Warrior, Fear, Doom Eternal, etc., but nothing has hit the itch the shotgun from Duke Nukem 3D scratches so damn well. Its rhythmic pounding of lead fury just feels great when it one-shots enemy after enemy. I also like the variety of enemies, the realistic locations, sci-fi feel, and the level of interactivity you get to enjoy. So it's such a role model to follow in the footsteps of. I began working on my take of the late 90s, early 2000s shooter. Obviously, there are modern bits of game engine gadgetry here and there, but the overall look and feel I want to go for is, and I hate to say it, retro. Just like every other shooter coming out right now. But while everyone is trying to imitate Quake, I want to imitate the build engine greats. The idea so far is to finish the first episode. There are three more after that, if I make it that far. Episode 1 starts with the hero waking up at his room after having a strange nightmare. You head downstairs to find your parents huddled together, lifeless, in a pool of blood. Black magic insignias and all sorts of bad voodoo is smack dab there in the living room. It was ritual sacrifice. With no cell service, you head to your neighbor's place to ask for help. He does his best to calm you, but in your rage you decide to take after whoever killed your parents having seen signs of someone heading down a trail into the woods. Your neighbor, unable to persuade you to wait for the police to arrive, gives you his pistol and locks the front door behind you. I have four different map areas, a variety of enemies, and a small lineup of weapons so far. I've used a mix of free assets from the Unity Asset Store and various other websites. A few of the models I've done myself, mainly architecture, but for the sake of time, a lot of content is placeholder right now, so I can focus on gameplay mechanics. More updates in the future.